Hello fellow tankers, welcome to YouTube channel of Hyundai. <clears throat> Today I'm gonna quickly show you how to override the issues with mods with the patch which came today in the morning in Europe uh, 9.15.2 So the main issue is with XVM what was confirmed XVM is working on an update and right now we can use every mod which was present in 9.15.1.1 if only it's not based or it's not using XVM so what to do how to start from the scratch we go to our folder with the game as you can see it's on my main drive and we make the copy we make the backup of our current mods as it might be case that it will be working when XVM will be updated that we will just reinstall the XVM and all mods will start working again but what to do now so I'm gonna copy that folder and I'm gonna move it into the save location I made a separate folder just for the purpose of the clip here and I'm copying as you can see it's pretty big because I have some skins uh, which are space consuming and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna show you how to install the mod pack one of the my favorite ones Asline you can try it also with other mod packs the only condition is that from the mod pack you have to pick up all the options which are not based or containing XVM in their code so let's start with the Asline checking for updates that's the version of Asline from yesterday for patch 9.15.1.1 so as you can see I'm actually making the installation of all the mod pack but it will be working uh, as you can see here the top section the XVM section that normally is ticked and you pick up options here you untick it so nothing based on XVM can be installed we scroll down scroll down everything here on top is based on XVM and here we have a section with the mod pack non XVM mod so every mod which is here it's just a mod not based on XVM so doesn't matter on your stats and I just picked up some random things the things which are usually installed with XVM and I just gonna press next what I pick up here is a clean installation which will delete everything what I have in rest mode that's why I made a backup at the beginning remember do the backup of your mods some of us are spending a lot of time adjusting the game to our special needs preferences <clears throat> so let's do the installation everything done hopefully yes done and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna do also in the same video right now I'm gonna show you how to install the old mod from the previous version and this is gonna be done on the example of the skin for AMX CDC that's the skin which I really enjoy, really like it. So we have the mod from the old version. We go into the zip file. We have the name of it. And as you can see, we're supposed to move it into rest mods folder 9.15.1.1. But let's go deeper and we have another folder here. I'm gonna copy that folder and I'm gonna go to my game folder and on my main drive games world of tanks rest mode let's go inside and what we can see here wow 9.15.1 that's incorrect don't worry so I go inside and I paste here that my one specific mode done but the game won't start right now because it's a newer client so what we have to do we have to right click on this and rename it so we're gonna remove those ones and we're gonna paste two and done job done right now what I'm gonna do I'm gonna try to start the game and let's see if it's gonna run play couple of moments as you can see no error messages so far everything seems to be working 
I picked up that one particular mod, that skin, just to be able to show you that mods are really working, even without going into the game. So let's log in. Uh, one of the mods which I use is Overworld in game, which shows me the team speak in game. I don't have to switch in between them. I can see here the message in the corner, right bottom corner. So that seems to be working. And as you can see, the garage uploaded. And I installed the skin for AMX CDC. So let's see. And voila, it works. Everything seems to be fine. So it means that it will be working also inside the game. One more very important thing. As you can see here, there are no locks. Um, a lot of us are using the, the mod which is preventing us from buying the gold. We know that there is a bug if you're gonna go to service and you're gonna go to premium ammunition. On default, it might change for a gold. Okay? There is also an option that you're gonna go to armory and you're gonna purchase the ammunition just for normal for cash not for gold but then you might not see it in inventory of your tank so this is a known bug so far there will be updates upcoming but the main purpose of that video was to show you how to use all the mods or how to install mod packs to have them at least partially working in the newest patch 9.15.2. Thank you for watching. If you liked it, hands up, subscribe, and see you soon.